Good morning from Costa Rica. Never waste an opportunity for a little uh, zip razor training. And uh, today I want to reach out very specifically on the handling of samples in your zip kits that you're getting. So as you know, this is a uh, evolving work in progress with Ash and I. Those samples don't come with covers for the razor. So you have two options. One is to be uh, very careful with them, obviously, and encourage people to be careful as you hand them out. And number two, you can use the plastic container that your monthly shipments come in kind of for covers until we figure out exactly what we're going to do. And all I do is I just obviously use half of it. So I, only, I always only give one razor uh, blade with a sample because I want to follow up with them promptly. And that's the thing I really want to focus on today is how to turn those samples into customers instead of into an awkward situation where someone has your sample did they use it? Are they going to be a customer? You don't want to harass them, so on and so forth. So if you break down the math in that zip kit, uh, very simply, each one of those samples is $10 out of your pocket. I treat it like it's $1,000. And here's what I mean by that. Before I hand someone a, a sample, I make sure they know that it's something I'm excited about, that I've had a great experience shaving with it, that I'm looking forward to their feedback. But it is a trade-off. It works like this. Hey, I would love to have you try this and get your feedback but i only have a few of these and so if i give it to you i got to know that you know within a day or two we're going to follow up and you let me know what you thought um, and even a more specific you know hey let's chat tomorrow morning after you shave with this uh, and see what you think you know and uh, kind of go from there uh, if you don't do that you can run into a situation where maybe somebody's trying to finish out the razors they have and it becomes a real lukewarm situation so make sure when you give it out that you have a specific follow-up when I follow up I very specifically say hey you know what did you think of it and uh, at that point I ask them for a sale I say hey would you prefer the six dollar a month or nine dollar a month and give them my link and sometimes walk them through the link uh, and help them place the order you can do that without being pushy all you have to do is be, I think, really sincere and recognize that's money they're spending anyway. You're not trying to get them to buy a trinket or something new. It's simply helping them get a better razor. One more caution. Make sure that you, when you give these to people, let them know it's probably more razor than they're accustomed to. What I mean by that is if you try to shave in a big hurry with a zip razor, my experience is some people will cut themselves because those are really sharp stainless steel blades and they're used to either a dull razor or a lower quality razor. So just say, hey, be careful, go slow as you do it. You're gonna get a closer shave, but if you're not careful, you can cut yourself. So I hope that gives you a little bit of ammunition. Um, I'm actually buying my third zip kit because uh, two reasons why. Number one, I wasn't real efficient with my first set of samples. So if you've experienced that, you're not alone. Number two, with my second set of samples, I was so efficient that uh, I'm out of them again already. So the trick I use on that is I don't purchase them under my account. Just talk to Ash directly via WhatsApp. I purchase them on one of my frontline affiliates. That way I get the $30 commission, if that makes sense to you, um, but just have it shipped to you. So um, I like having a fresh set of samples all the time for when I'm traveling. Also with the holidays coming up, you know, passing them out at Thanksgiving, passing them out with the assurance that they're gonna follow through and that I'm gonna follow up. A good term you can use on that, I know I'm bouncing around here a little bit, is hey, I wanted to provide a cur courteous and professional follow through. That way you're not being pushy, you're being courteous and professional by following up in a timely manner, seeing what they thought of it, and asking for the sale. All right, hope that helps. Everybody have a great Zip Razor day.